Welcome to another episode of Kufia Chronicles with the Cape May Lake Choir Board Youth Council. I am Diane Dramat and today I'm here with Kuta Ashraf. Assalamualaikum. And they are from the Rangers Malay Choir. Um, I see here guys that there's a lot of memorabilia here on the, on the table of Rangers a Sporting Club over the years. There's pictures. Yeah. I see the badges on everything. Um, let's just get into the branding of the club. Like, can you explain how the badge originated or anything? Yes, uh, I can do it. Assalamu alaikum to all the listeners there. Um, in those years, well, it's wrong past my, my uh, or people wrong before me, <coughs> they worked as tailors. And uh, for some reason, one of the guys which the Mas'uds then picked up a, 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 a sort of a, a arm at an extra form. That was in the main road, Salter or somewhere there. Mm-hmm. And they took pictures of this R with a fern on. And they brought it back to the uh, uh, old District 6, uh, where we were all at. It was all uitgesmeted. But nevertheless, and so they put that thing uh, to the committee at that time, which was Mr. April. Mind you, Mr. April is one of the founders of, of Rangers Sankorn. Oh. Uh, by yourself, he was, one of, he was oh. the secretary at that time. That was in the 1963, 1964 time. So they took the banner and brought it uh, to the committee. They took it. It was not a garage, it was a garage. So now, on the lekker with sisters and what. And everybody was happy. So they, from that time, 19, say, let's say 59 to 63, where the body sunk. To fat the dice a little bit, mm-hmm. and and from that years, uh, the badge was probably originated. And remind you, uh, gentlemen, <coughs> this is the only registered <coughs> badge up in Pretoria. We've got all the records still. So this is a registered oh. badge that they chose that time. Uh, yeah. So this this is now the the, the big R one. With the that badge. is the big yes, R coming see... from the Rangers. Uh, I mean, from Rex through from badge at that time, seeing on the face. Yes, because I see there's a lot of updates here and there. Absolutely. But the main badge is the big R. The badge. main badge comes from uh, as the yeah. of Rex through from uh, okay. factory. Okay, okay, that's good history. Now. Let's get into the history of the choir. The choir has been through many ups and downs, as a lot of people know. Um, is there any highlights for you, maybe for Putawani, any highlights of the club that, uh, that you can share with the team, with the people? Yes. Um, in my short time with Rangers, right, I've been with Rangers since 2009, when we've been a rebel. Right? We've been a rebel for three years. And then, you won't believe it, Rafi Domingo, mm-hmm. who's yeah. our lead singer now, he was at Padres at that time. Oh, and really? I can still remember as it happened, as in yesterday, they were singing Prisoner Cup mm. in the Guru Center, and he was standing on the back of my bucket and he shouted at me, Uncle Wari, or had he been a rebel, or had the team stage to fight? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, was that now? Or had the team stage to fight? Mm-hmm. All right? So, yes, in the first three years, it was a struggle. He was starting with us. We couldn't sing. We had four or five guys here in the team that can mm-hmm. really sing. The others, no. The, the majority of our guys came from Maria because me and Uncle Fadi was yeah. involved with the re-track mm-hmm. rehabilitation. So we tried to put it like this in and keep them on a mm-hmm. on a straight path, you know? So yes, it was a struggle. 2016, then we turned the whole thing around, all right? From yeah. no opus to giant slayers. Absolutely, <laughs> right? absolutely. To giant slayers. Absolutely. Definitely. And that was the headlines in the four lupuchi at that point in time. Mm. Mushfika Bota was the uh, author of the, of the four lupuchi. Big so giant slayers. All right? <laughs> we slaughtered them in yeah, 2016. Well, well, There's yeah. proof of it. Yeah. 18 trophies in two singing competitions. There was, no, there was no grand finale. It was mm. only the top eight in the section. Alright? Yes, I'm not going to mention the team that we slaughtered, but they know who they are. Yeah. All right? They know who they are. Alright? And that was the one highlight. Alright? Yeah. Last year, another highlight. We lost 28 guys. You. 28 guys. Yeah. Alright? Some went to a club within the Cape Lake Hawaii board, mm-hmm. and some went to the Keep the Dream. <coughs> Alright? They opened their own club. When we started the new season last year, we started with 11 guys, mm. all right? Yeah. With 11 original guys from the year before. Mm. We never went to any other club or approached any other members from other clubs to come and join us. 
Mm. What we did is, we put in like this from the Rangers Rugby Club mm. and from the Collegians Rugby Club, all right? And we took stage with close to 50, 48. That's correct, yeah. 48 yeah. guys. Yeah. And as you all know, we won the section last year and we won the top eight last year. With the same like this, the inexperience like this. So that was my second highlight. Um, yes. Brilliant, brilliant highlight. Yes. Um, I see a lot of hard work went into this team and you guys are very passionate about the team. Um, yes. Rangers is a, a team that inspires me a lot because, I mean, the, the team came from very humble beginnings, especially when they reopened again yeah. now. Yes. And, I mean, the team really took it far. Yes, and you yourself was at the Rangers. Yeah. Your mother, your daddy. <laughs> yes. The old Rama family was That time, yes. when uh, Signal was still saying. That was 2016. Yeah. Yes. yes, you were part of the 2016 squad, yes. Yes, yeah. so we yes. Were, now it's very inspiring to hear. Yes, yeah. Um, yeah, besides on the stage, what other highlights is there that you can you can share? Maybe like, maybe in the close cam or whatever. You see the other thing that's happening here at the Rangers is, no? we, when we open, mm. like I just said, we had no neighboring coaches, no neighboring lead singers. Mm. And up to today, we don't go outside our club to replace <sighs> somebody. Mm. We do it within the club, all right? 2016, we had Butadini, Perinolato, yeah. all right? Mm. He never coached no other choir. We gave him a chance at the Rangers. Mm. And he won the highest points, which, was, which is called the Burger Cup. Mm. He won it in the section and he won it in the top eight. Tari Blutnot came from a cool fraternity yeah. to Rangers. He had no experience, all right? But they choir. Mm, mm, mm. You want a comic? Um, highest price. And at the Velodrome. Also the first yeah. price. Highest price. Yeah. So yes, at the Rangers, we give everybody a chance. You want to come coach? Come coach. All right? You want to be a lead singer? Come. Okay. Rafik Domingo, which opened the team in 2011, he's back at the Rangers. Yeah. All right? And he's such an inspiration to the youngsters. It's unbelievable. Mm. He's a, he had, to, he had to fill big boots. He had to fill for East Abrams' boots. Mm. As, he, as you all know, for East was a brilliant coach and mm. singer. Rafi had to fill his boots and Rafi done it. Brilliant, yeah, absolutely. And his, yeah. Rafi, he's got the answers behind him. <coughs> and that's very important. Mm. As Ramis, our, 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 our combined coach, mm. he's got the answers behind him. So yes, um, what, within the ranges, we always look for the next lead singer, for the next coach. Yeah. That's really yes. nice. That's really yeah. nice. Um, let's move on. So I see that um, Rangers is this team that like they on top at the moment, right? So being that team in, on top, is the anything that the organization can do to, to help you guys? Or maybe like what is your opinion on what the, the Cape Malay Choir Board organization is actually doing? Yes. Um, First of all, um, the Cape Malay Choir Board Executive, as it is now, mm. I got tremendous respect for them. Right? Um, within a couple of months, in their existence, they've done more than what the previous um, executive did. Mm. I don't want to, to degrade yeah, nobody yeah. or whatever, mm. all right? But to me, in the first, in the first month, they secured the Edlund Stadium for us, mm. they secured the City Hall for us, yeah. all right? Which is like last year, we were, are we going to sing or are we not going to sing? Mm. Are we going to sing or are we not? Because we were unsure about the venues and the times. All right? That disrupts your preparation for competition. Mm. Now we know we're singing at this date and we're marching at that date so we can prepare ourselves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right? So, yes, a thumbs up to this new executive. Okay. A big thumbs up to them. And I got, I got, they got my support 100%. Absolutely. 100%. And then us here yeah, as a youth council, we just also um, like want to know if is there anything that we can do better, maybe, or anything that you see that you that know this is history. Never mm -hmm. ever in the Cape Malay Kauai board or in any other organization was it a youth council, and with with your executive, mm -hmm. with your executive existing executive now yeah. backing you, you can only go to Kerita Heights, Absolutely. right? And you. what you must do is learn from them. They guide you, right? Like by us at the Rangers. I wasn't at our function last night. Mm. Mm. But the feedback that I got 
The reason why I couldn't be there, I just came from from Khat, you know, so I, it was around the yeah. 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 right? But from the feedback that I got, like, we got guys like Buta Maile, Buta Ami, Shafi, mm. they don't remember this work. So I feel that the Rangers is in good hands, mm. in very good, and then it's, go, it's going to go for <laughs> you as well. So if anybody should step down from executive mm. level, they can be sure their replacement is, will be Guaranteed. capable to fulfill the big, big books. Just to come in there, but Tawani, you know, I walked in the, um, in, in the wall last night and I had to stand up and a gentleman that I approached and I took his hand, which I think is, is the secretary of the club at the moment. Yes. I was just forced to stand up mm. to see this gentleman sacrifice his sort of married life to be so committed with the Rangers. And shukran, Mr. Secretary. I, it, it, <laughs> it, it feels with our open, we can sit and relax yes, and, and you guys will take it over. Definitely. And that, that, to all of you, executive, which is uh, Mr. The Sunny, Amin, the Amin. Amin, and the <laughs> captain, I had big respect. I mean, I, and I, even every season, I will tell Mr. Captain, well done. We, we, we can rest, rest and just look at them. Yeah. Alhamdulillah. Yes. Mr. Yeah. Trada mustn't forget. I know he will only sit for the day. Everything but it's a problem. But nevertheless, <laughs> um, I, I feel very honored from uh, Mr. Trout and uh, 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 Dawani for, <coughs> I'm a little bit on retirement, so they gave me this honor to be like president. But I'm still there, believe me, whatever. <laughs> so I should for you guys in the executive. But no, I'm there, I'm there. And what they mustn't forget, the, 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 the youth of the Rangers, mm. right? They must always honor the elderly. Like we, when the Rangers organize a, a, a function, okay. our first invitation is going to the elderly, right? Because they are the people that we approach for yes, this yes, badge. Yes, we yes. can use this badge. Absolutely. They, Absolutely. they were the people we had to approach him. Put a naughty, put a ballo, put a jaw auto araham, and Tina Dima can. Those were the people that we had to approach because we just couldn't take the badge. Mm. Yes. We just couldn't take it for granted that, yes, we we um, uh, rebel, yeah. right? We fall under the Rangers banner. Mm. No, we are going to go to stage now. We're going to go to, into competition, mm. all right? So we needed <laughs> their permission, and the ends of fact that we always honor them. They are the first, you can ask oh, Mr. Tarao, they are the first people that get the invitations to all functions. So that goes for you people also, right? the youngsters. Always, always honor the yeah. elderly. I, mean, I, mean, I think on a, to end on a, on a, on a, oh, yes. on a little note, um, what can we expect from Rangers this year? Are, oh, we, yes, are we coming? Definitely or? we're coming. I was, I was, I was <laughs> taken there. You see, <laughs> you see to, to, to achieve something is one thing, all right? Mm. But to, to do it again, in the game, in the game, it takes hard work. Yeah, People yeah. is going to come for They're you. Other choices is going to come for you. Yeah, All right. Yeah. <laughs> I, I heard. Of, I'm not going to mention his name. I heard in one of your interviews, this one manager of the squad or the owner, I don't know. He said he's going to come for us. I just want to remind him. The last he won the Rangers was 2015. The last time he beat the Rangers was 2015. <laughs> Right? <laughs> and he knows who he is. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I think yes. I think that is a good note to get. <laughs> shukran, shukran. I'm for, for a few guys. Shukran, all, shukran, the best shukran, shukran. all the best for you guys. Uh, young executive, take yeah. this Cape Malay choir boat to another level. Yeah. Okay, nice. shukran for watching Kufia Chronicles, guys. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. Yeah. Allah.